Are you ready? Let it bounce What is up guys? We're in Miami right now. We're here at the, the dialing crib with all the guys. I'm here with Joey. Joey's been in insurance for about a year right now. So we're gonna go meet the guys, see what's going on. In a typical day, what we're doing is we're dialing. So Sundays are typically slower. We typically handle people 50 to 85. But today we're gonna be regrouping. We're gonna do some workshops. We're gonna be hooping later. So stay tuned. What's up? My name is Joey Schwartz. I work with Insumed's brokerage. Uh, I've been in the business for about 18 months. After working with Sumed for a few months, we're able to get a G-Wagon, make a lot more money, scale our business, and uh, it's going better than it's ever gone before. These are all the boys. This is the group that we've been moving with. This is Andrew Buff, brand new agent. Started killing it, 30K weeks off the bat. What's going on, Buff? Here we go, yes sir. Karma Financial, nobody does it better. And next we got Sonny, Sonny the man. What's going on, y'all? My name's Sonny, I'm from LA. I've been in the business for about six months now, and that shit prints. We're only 20 years old. A lot of us know each other from high school or just from growing up together, and what we've, what we've been able to do, it's been crazy. This is Jack right here. My name is Jack. I was actually stocking shelves at a grocery <laughs> store, and now I'm printing money with insurance. So it's been a dream come true, man. A lot of us started as just dialers writing business, and then slowly we started transitioning more into management. So right here is AP. AP is the one who's been in the business with me the longest. Yes, sir. I know Joy from elementary school. All three of us went to the same elementary school. Dropped out of college. I was fixing cars, and then he put me on life insurance. And then Jonah, I know from, uh, I think, like preschool. Uh, another college dropout. Yeah, no, we used to work at Subway, was in college for a year, decided to drop out and pursue this. Best decision I ever made. And then last, but most definitely not least, we got Wyatt. I'm going I'm, I'm to just hand him the mic. Wyatt, 20 years old, Los Angeles, born and raised. High school dropout turned 800K in a month thanks to this guy. Karma Financial Life Insurance, come on. What is up guys, we're with the Karma Boys. We're about to get some hoops in. So uh, join us for this hoop sesh. Ways I run my companies is I like to get everybody active and bam, look at me, fire off this three. Swish, man, am I nice. But in all seriousness, a lot of companies will take their staff out to restaurants, to bars, to cigar lounges, but we like to get the guys a little active because you know, it keeps the blood flowing, keeps us energetic, builds a team culture, builds a camaraderie, and also keeps people competitive. So whenever we get the chance, we try to get everybody out on the court, on the field, doing something physical to just keep those energy levels up because while making money is good, health is the greatest wealth. What is up guys, we just got done playing some basketball, got some cardio in, we're gonna go get some food, so we'll check out where we're gonna go eat. The guy that we were talking about, like the guy that we were talking about, that's him. <laughs> We were talking about. We were just no, talking about. That's, that's that is actually crazy. That's not the first time this has that is actually crazy. That just. No, we're just like TJR trades on. Like, no, he lives in this building. No, he lives in our building. And they just walked out. That was him. <laughs> that's crazy. That is like. It happened with the alarm. The odds of that happening are, are crazy. Lambo, G wagon, and we're ready to go. One of the coolest things I love about Miami itself is there's always some stuff going on. Here we see a bunch of bikers. They're staring at the Lambo as we drive by. And and this is super cool to see. You know, the city just has a lot of energy, has a lot of life. And that's something that I always love to be a part of. This one is gasoline, premium gasoline for a premium person. They put gasoline based off how you are as a person. So the better person you are, oh, red, red. supreme, red to red. We this had is, blue, you put blue. Oh, this is blue, red. We had dark blue, blue, blue. See, black, black, and red to red. So this is how coloring goes. Matching. Matching. What is up, guys? We are in the lamb truck, heading to dinner. We're going to go to this restaurant called Steak tonight. It's supposed to be really nice. It's supposed to have some good food. Hella people here. So uh, we'll check it out. Man, I can't talk enough about the vibes of Miami. Honestly, moving here, elevating my lifestyle. I got a VIP detail now that kind of follows me around with an Escalade, driving the Lamb truck. Life is a lot different. 
and in a good way too. Seeing the city, the architecture, the buildings, just the things that people have here, the restaurants, the influencers, the celebrities, it motivates you. It makes you want to do more. It makes you want to be more. So one of the biggest things I tell a lot of young people is, if you want to elevate your life and really do more, move to a large city. Change your surroundings. Change your environment. The cars. Man, I can't even talk about the cars. Like There are so many exotic cars here, and it just makes you inspired. It makes you want to grow. It makes you want to build. So I highly recommend you move to a large city if you're an entrepreneur, if you're trying to build a business, anything like that. That's the move that you should do. It will change your life. Alrighty guys, you already know how it is, Sumi the Builder, putting everything together. Check out this desk I just got. It's absolutely stupid. It's kind of one of those desks that goes up and down, but the place is coming together. You know, I got this little mirror that I put up in the corner there. The podcast setup is coming around. You're going to see the place evolve. I got a few paintings that I got to put up, but guys, seriously, check out the vlogs that are coming up because you're going to see more and more of the place and how it's going to be put together. But appreciate you guys. Until next time, Sumi out.